am Miss Julie Rouse. I'm a newspaper advisor, and as always, with me today, Mr. Aaron Stevie, the yearbook advisor here at Bellevue West High School in the Midwest. <laughs> and and this week, uh, we were just talking about what we should talk about, and I asked. Mr. Stewie, do you feel stressed? And I'm trying to articulate what it means to feel stressed. And it's not a stress that is um, like things aren't getting done. It's a, it's like this free falling without a net. And what's going to happen? Because everything is actually going really well. Um, my editors are doing their jobs, and my reporters are doing their jobs, and. Um, and I've actually read some stories this week, and we have some really good things getting getting published. We've, uh, we're on the web, if I may plug, tinyurl.com backslash B, as in boy, Westwind. And that will take you to our homepage, and we have two stories up there right now, this week. And I think that's a pretty big accomplishment. Um, but it is. It's like falling without a net. That's how I feel. I cannot, I cannot say anything more eloquent than that. Um, it's been a, it's been stressful, but not where, not where I'm worried about deadlines or anything like that. I'm just starting. The reality of what we're doing is really starting to set in, and you know I'm dealing with uh, here in at, at our school, Bellevue West, uh, as the yearbook rep, I deal with picture day and organize that. And that's been one extra duty that's I think I've earned my advisor pay with. <laughs> um, so that's on top of, you know, the everyday duties, uh, and yeah, it's, I'm not worried about the kids, they seem to be working, and you know, even though I'm pretty ignorant about what's going on, um, I like to think I maintain a good uh, figurehead kind of a stance, I, uh, yeah, I think so, we'll see, we'll see. I can't wait though to watch these little vlogs in May. <laughs> see how innocent we were and naive <laughs> and then uh, maybe we're gonna be bitter and I'll have gray hair on the sides. I'll just quit dyeing mine and I'll <laughs> completely gray and I won't even care anymore because what's the point I'm sure. See this is good because we could still joke about, about our, uh, our situation. It's when we stop joking. I have heard that before, that yeah. once you stop joking, that's when you know that things are really dire. And so the <laughs> fact that we're still able to joke. And really, and, and it really is just, when because we are new, and, and I've done this before for one year, but I don't remember because it was so long ago. Right. And and But it is, it's, I feel like it's, it's going well. And I think that part of my stress too, come, and yours too probably, <clears throat> I don't, we don't just do this, so I teach... Uh, right now three additional classes and so mm -hmm. the day just is I'm doing one thing and another and then another and another and um, it and does make the day go fast yeah but this is always on your mind like yeah. the, the publication it's it's not like a, it's not like a class right it's not it's being an advisor is completely different than being a teacher yes it's it's completely different and such is life such is life but it's a good life so far Hey. So, yeah. yeah, so far. So far. Cross your fingers. So, anything else we need to say? I, I think that's pretty good. I don't have okay. any. I don't have anything this week. I can't wait to hear the picture day report. <laughs> Next Friday. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Bye. Bye. -bye. <laughs>